Getting a new company off the ground is no easy task, but passion can lead to profit if you find the right partners. Scott Sanborn joins us now with a colorful example you'll only see on Fox 28 News. No business can survive by operating in the red, so three local entrepreneurs are encouraged that their brand new product is already in the black. It's a promising start for blue, created in the corridor. So come get some good stuff. <laughs> Dozens of local businesswomen recently gathered in Cedar Rapids to beat the winter blues, but they ended up enjoying some blue. What are you drinking? Blue vodka. And what do you think? It's very good, very good. It's all male all natural. It's all natural, fruity, it's very good. It's smooth, it's uh, refreshing, and as the label says, 100% delicious, and it's 100% delicious. Blue Vodka ripened into a promising brand just a couple of years after Elizabeth Jetter. Would you mind making a pillarita? And Britt Jetter met another entrepreneur with a secret family recipe for infused liqueurs. My family has been making infused liqueurs for generations and all of the kids know how to do it. Whenever I'd bring it to parties, people would say, when are you gonna bottle this? The answer came when Dr. Tony Vandenbush brought a sample to a downtown bar for the Jetters to taste. We asked the bar if they had some disposable cups and they gave us a couple of styrofoam cups and we walked around back down by the river under, under the bridge or next to the bridge. <laughs> We had a paper bag with some of the product and we're pouring it in styrofoam cups down by the river to try the product. And he talked about vodka and I was like, you know what, I think that will work. You know, with my background in supply chain, uh, with Coca-Cola, I was there for 12 years and also I have a customer service background. So I thought that was like the perfect fit to move forward. After maneuvering through the complicated licensing maze, the trio began handcrafting small batches in Cedar Rapids using locally distilled vodka along with wild blueberries for their original and orange zest for their citrus offering. No artificial flavorings are colored. A true infusion of liquor is about fruit, real fruit, and the flavor and the color being extracted from it via a steeping process. Honestly, before this, I wasn't a drinker, okay? So, but after this, it's like, well, I have to do product tasting. Blue hit the market a year ago January, and it's already proving fruitful at grocery stores and bars. Last October, we made our first profit. The fact that we're in over 75 locations here in Iowa, and also branching out into Chicago. Meanwhile, back at the party. Oh, yes, this is the citrus. Yes. Yes. I'm enjoying it. How does it compare to other products that you've had like this? I think it's great. I'm not a huge liqueur drinker, but I, I really like it a lot. Feedback's been great. The feedback's been wonderful. We're really proud. My family's proud that it's kind of going out there and people are liking it. The company is now seeking investors with hopes of expanding globally. We have a link to more information about Blue Vodka under this story at fox28iowa.com.